That's because his offense is just so dynamic and dominating. I can't wait to see what we get from him here tonight. This may be the loudest I've ever heard. Such emotion here. Yeah, what's going to happen? We had a feeling this would happen. Yeah, they really don't want to wait. This is a wreck. He's moving like an uncaged animal. No lie, he's wild in there. Very curious move to go for a pinfall at this point, right, Ken? Yeah, this guy's got too much energy left in him. Plenty of fight left. You're right, this guy's still near 100%. What do you think about Brock Lesnar? Seeing how dominant Brock Lesnar has been in recent years sure does make me glad I retired. Here's the thing, this match of course isn't for the championship, but the champ can't afford to look past this one. If he does, he can lose momentum or even worse, get an injury. In the pantheon of finishers, Brock Lesnar's F5 has got a rank right near the top. Does it not? Oh, without a doubt. The list of victims that the Beast is subjected to that move is like a who's who of WWE greats. No one is immune to it. Roman Reigns has found an answer here. What an incredible lariat! Of all the names on that list of Brock Lesnar's F5 victims, the one that stands out the most to me is Big Show. I mean, we're talking about a seven foot tall, 500 pound giant, and Brock Lesnar picked him up at the 2014 Royal Rumble, walked around the ring with him, and completely destroyed him with the F5. Wow, what a slam to the ground. How will these guys do with absorbing the punishment they're about to receive out here? Boy, there's no way he's going to be able to stand after that. Ken, just look at this man. He's all business. And that's the way he has to be if he wants to win here tonight. The F5 Brock Lesnar performed on the big show at the Royal Rumble was a spectacle, the likes of which we've rarely ever seen. But, King, earlier you alluded to the other legends the Beast has used the F5 on. Oh, you mean like Kurt Angle at WrestleMania 19? Or that John Cena fella? Well, how about The Rock at SummerSlam in 2002? That was when Brock Lesnar won his first WWE Championship and officially became the next big thing. If he keeps up this pace, this could turn real ugly real fast. He drops the elbow. It looks like we're going to see what kind of pain they can inflict out here on the floor. Nice reversal there. He anticipated that move perfectly. He may be in the best physical condition I've ever seen him in. Down goes Roman Reigns. You can see him struggling to stand after all the damage he's taken. You know, one thing that brought... He's sending a message to the entire WWE locker room here. When he gets going like this, there are a few better. He saw that one coming. Oh, boy. He's got him up there, Cole. In the crucifix. And now... Ah, power bomb! What a combination. Oh, this is insane. What do we got here? Brock Lesnar with a nice reversal. Without a doubt, the city of Boston is home to some of the greatest fans in sports entertainment. Just listen to this passion. And now it's Brock Lesnar. My God, his body's been through hell, and his ribs 
have bore the brunt of the attack. And I hope we can get a doctor out here as a precaution. Damaged ribs like that can make it hard to breathe. He looks absolutely exhausted. This is clearly not the same competitor who started this match in such great shape. Lesnar. Count of 20. What a finish. He may get the three count right there. Going to be close. These competitors trying to keep their wits about them. Well, Cole, it's so important not to lose your cool in a match like this, not to lose your focus. You make a mistake, and I guarantee you, your opponent is going to capitalize on it. These guys are giving it absolutely everything they've got. Oh, man! That's it. Did you hear that? I'm just glad I didn't feel it. And again, he gets struck with that object. Whoa. You've oh, not again. Not again. How many more chair shots can they take? Oh, man. Now you're talking about... And will this be it? It may One. be. Three. And somehow he's able to get out. Man, that was close. He simply refuses to stay down. The city of Boston has played host to some of sports entertainment's greatest moments, including the night Stone Cold Steve Austin captured the WWE Championship from Shawn Michaels at WrestleMania 14. He's pulling out all the stops tonight. Look at that reversal. What strength. And they may have made a mistake thinking that Lesnar was finished. And at this point, you have to wonder if he can recover from this. Wow, these guys aren't giving an inch, but at some point, one of them got to start pulling away, which is what we might be seeing right now. And given the aggressive outpouring we've seen so far, I wouldn't be surprised if this one was over sooner than later. That'll have you worrying about long-term injuries for sure. How will these guys do with absorbing the punishment they're about to receive out here? King, we're about to take a little trip. Oh, no. Yes. I'm afraid you're right. Suplex City. That's some place nobody wants to go. Want to take a trip, John? Hell no. Suplex City. He's got to be history. Is he still even conscious? Oh, man. Man. Without a doubt, the city of Boston is home to some of the greatest fans in sports entertainment. Just listen to this passion.